Hey guys, it's Cameron and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a wig haul. Janet Collection was kind enough to send me out these wigs today and sponsor this video for you guys. I thought this would be perfect because a lot of you guys are interested in wigs just like me, but also we are going into Halloween time. So synthetic wigs are perfect for that. Not only can you use them for Halloween, but you can also use them everyday basis when you don't want to do your hair. So they did send me out five wigs. I have some curly haired wigs and I have some straight haired wigs. I will have all these wigs linked down in the description box down below. We're going to start out with the longest one first because that's the one I'm most excited for. So The first wig that we have is the Bisa wig. I got this in a color one. The scalp on these things are like literally insane. Like it, it is crazy. They're getting so good with synthetic wigs these days. It's nuts. It does feel like real hair. We'll have to say that this wig, it does shed quite a bit. Like it's shedding. I don't know if you guys can see that, but... It's shedding quite a bit already. It does tangle quite easily at the ends. Always bear in mind that synthetic wigs are not going to be like real hair wigs. They are really just like for, you know, a little fun every once in a while. You want to change your look real quick, but they're not going to be a long-term thing. It is big head friendly. I do have a big head. It also has little straps here, like a little bra clip. So if you do have a smaller head, you can adjust it. So I'm going to cut the tag off and cut the lace off, and then I will show it to you guys when I have it on. So I went through, I brushed through Ms. Bisa. I literally did not do anything to this parting or anything. I did not pluck this wig. Obviously, as you could tell, that's where it starts. Those are my baby hairs. Like I told you guys, I'm not like really, really laying it. I need to cut that piece off too. <laughs> We're just gonna ignore that. I'm not super, super laying it because obviously I have to show you guys um, a bunch more wigs, but this wig is super super nice. My only issue with it is that it just sheds like crazy Like literally I just brushed through one time and it sheds a lot like a lot so what is insane to me is just how Amazing this lace is like this does have a clip. It's in the side I love my clips to be in the side more than in the front because I feel like if they're in the front, they start to like give me a headache. So I just love when wigs have clips in the side. I will show you guys the back of this wig. I am 5'4", so it comes down to about almost right above my butt. It's got really pretty texture to it. Definitely would wear it for like pictures or something, but I would not wear this wig on like an everyday basis, I would say, just because it does tangle up so much. I would say, with synthetic wigs, try not to touch them too much because they do tangle pretty easily. Look how gorgeous that is. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And this scalp is just what kills me. Like, that is insane. It is a free part wig. So, this is probably one of the more comfortable wigs that I've ever worn. I typically, I have a pretty big head. So, usually for me, wigs are super, super uncomfortable. I don't even think that I would put any kind of baby powder on this because this wig just looks so so incredibly natural. I absolutely love it. It is really just like a pop and go wig. Like you don't have to take any time into it. There's beautiful cut layers. It feels like real hair. It looks like real hair. The scalp is just insane. Um, it's absolutely gorgeous. We are gonna move on to the next wig. It is basically um, kind of like a bob version of this. And if y'all know me, I just love, 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 love bob. Right now that I look even crazier. <laughs> this is the Asia wig in the color one as well. I believe that it has the same kind of lace. Yes, it is the Mount 13 by six frontal part. This pretty much feels and looks exactly like the other hair. This one, for some reason, I'm noticing is not tangling the same. I think because it is shorter. Short hair wigs don't seem to tangle as much at the end. Once again, this like lace here is insane. I'm pretty much like a wig for dummies kind of person. So I love wigs like this. They're just super easy. You just slap them on, you go. All right, so I just cut off the lace, but I wanted to show you guys the inside of this, which basically looks exactly the same like the Bisa wig. It has this little strap and it has a back clip and two side clips, which I love. So this is basically like an asymmetrical bob. I always call them auntie bobs. <laughs> this is a perfect shape also for Halloween. It's pretty much just like the Bisa. This is just like a super sleek, gorgeous look. So as you can see, it is a asymmetrical 
bob. I think this is probably going to be like your easiest wig to wear out that you're not going to have to be brushing all the time. So that makes it a really, really good wig. I love, 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 love this one. I think that it's super cute. If it were me, I would probably like cut this because I like a more um, symmetrical bob. But like I said, it's a little out of my comfort zone, but I think that it's really pretty and really cute. I did not do anything to the parting. I basically just slapped these wigs on. So this makes it really easy and like a perfect everyday wear piece. But it is really, it's great. Like, oh my God, look at that. If you really took the time to get this to blend in and everything, which I'm not doing right now because we have too much to do, but I think that this is absolutely gorgeous. Like this is your easy, everyday kind of wearing wig. I think this one might be my favorite. I'm not sure. Maybe. We'll see. All right. So we're going to move on to the next wig, which is kind of like a wavy wig. I love some body and some texture. Just love some texture. So we're going to jump into that one. Um, I think this is from a different collection. This is the Essentials. This is Courtney, also in the color one. This one is a little bit shinier than the others. The lace is different on this one, I am noticing, but it is still pretty good. And it feels super lightweight. So I think this would be a great everyday wig. It does not have that little strap thing on the inside. It does have two combs on the side and one in the back, so that's great. This is more of like, this is seriously like a put on and go. Like you ain't got no time. You just need to put your hair on and let's go. It does also come with a little bit of some baby hairs in the front. So I'm gonna actually brush out these curls because I feel like they are just a little too tight together for me. Oh, it is super cute when you brush it out. I love that. Oh my God, I really, really like this. I'm not noticing that much shedding, like one or two pieces, which is great. Okay, this is absolutely gorgeous. Freaking beautiful. And I don't even think that it needs any dry shampoo or anything because now that I brushed it out, it seems more natural. Oh my God, I love this. Look at this, you guys. So cute. So pretty. This is not pre-plucked, so, and I love curly wear hair wigs like this because they can withstand looking a little bit more frizzy, a little bit more voluminous than you would be able to with a straight haired wig. Because it has some body and some wave to it, it's okay if it looks a little frazzled because it kind of gives you that like, oh, I just woke up, but I still look good. I'm going to cut you. Absolutely stunning. This one I definitely will be wearing a lot. All right, let's move on to the next one. The next two are very curly. I'm excited for these. I think we're gonna have to tweak around with them a little bit, but they should be very pretty. We'll see what we can do. First one that we're going to do is dark hair because we're in dark hair. It's winter, so. This is the natural hairline and natural yakky texture, natural me lace wig, 13 by six frontal part. This is Kiera in the color two. This is once again, like this is an auntie wig. I think it's supposed to be like wand curls kind of look, but the roots are very straight. Seems to be like really good lace. So it does have two clips in the front and it does have a clip in the bottom. And then it also has a little stretchy band right here so you can tighten it. She's gonna need some help. <laughs> All right, so this is Miss Kira straight out of the box. She comes in this like side part. Um, I'm not loving so much these straight roots. What I think that I'm going to do is I'm going to turn this into a fro. Probably going to cut some bangs into this like right about here. And then we're going to really jizz this up and get some life into her and see if we can do something. We've never really done stuff like this. <laughs> I just see people do it in YouTube videos. So I like to cut curl by curl. We're going up. I don't want to cut too high on the bangs with this just because remember that the top is very straight. So I'm going to pretty much leave it like this and I'm gonna take some um, some hair like bobby pins and just pin it up like this so that the bangs hold so this is kind of what we have going for us this gives me like major scissor vibes so I'm going to use a pick and I'm going to comb through this because once we get all of these like perfectly perfect perm rod curls with some life in them this is going to look 10 times better. Okay, maybe I might wear this one today. Who knows? 
That's why you can't judge a curly wig straight out of the box. Oh my god, you guys, this is insane. I love this hair. It's the volume for me. Oh, this makes me want to dye my hair black so bad. I want darker hair. Imagine you do like a little ponytail like this, like that. Y'all, I don't know about y'all, but when I took that out of the box, I was like, mm. look, uh, it's, it's a pretty length. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, Kiera. Okay, let's move on. I love this wig. I think it's incredible. All right, last one is a burgundy wig. I have not done burgundy hair color since I had my mental breakdown freshman year. And I only had burgundy hair for three days before I dyed it back blonde. So this will be a, like a trip down memory lane. We'll see if I really, really like it. This is um, a part of the same exact collection. This is Yana in 99J. So it's this burgundy color. It's basically the same thing as this wig. It's just a little bit shorter. It has the same exact cap construction. So I'm gonna do the same thing as this wig. I'm going to cut some um, bangs into it. Um, kind of pick them up a little bit with bobby pins and pick out the rest of this hair so <laughs> i've gone ahead and i've picked it out a bunch don't know if it's so much me i'm not really a burgundy hair person but i do think that this is really cute if you are a burgundy hair person i think this is going to be fire on you i like it don't get me wrong i do like it i love the shape of it i love how natural it feels and it looks it has the same exact feel as the other wig I just don't know if I'm a burgundy person. I don't know if I like burgundy on me. If you guys like this hair color, let me know. It gives me strawberry shortcake vibes. I would definitely get this wig like in a darker brown or in a black. I think that's super cute. This is the back. So it's very full. It's got a lot of life to it. I do think that this burgundy is gorgeous. It reminds me a lot of like Rihanna. I think that it's so pretty. I really like this length and this shape. Let me know which wig was y'all's favorite. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I like them all. all right, that so. is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you are interested in any of the wigs, please make sure to check them out down below. I just wanna give a huge thank you to Janet Collection for sponsoring this video. I am obsessed with all these wigs. And once again, just an emphasis, like even though I do do sponsored posts and sponsored videos, I want you guys to know that everything I say is completely honest and with my own true opinion. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up as well as subscribe. Go check out Janet Collection. I have been a long time buyer of their wigs. I will see you guys next time. Bye. Making money like a man.